dose of Sadie's gaming infection. Ultron Echo shot me. Apparently, Condemned 2 didn't have enough guns in it, so somehow she obtained a real gun and shot me. So this week I'm prescribing Saints Row 2 for the Xbox 360. Hopefully that will satisfy her. I told Dr. Sadie to stay off my turf. If she comes over here again, she's really gonna get it. But anyway, let's play some Saints Row 2. I need some people in the background of my show that just go, yeah, ha ha, woo, what she just said. These cops are all like gangsters. They got like tattoos, fucking mirror's edge tattoos and ear piercings. Shanky. Put him over there. Oh, thank you very much, Zine. Throwback. Sex brace build age. Is that like a haiku? Oh my god, look at all these choices you have. This is amazing. I could be Buffy, I mean Burly, Burly the Vampire Slayer, personality. <gasps> you can choose your voice? This is so... I ain't around this time. That is cool. I don't think I'm a badass. I know it. Ooh, she's got a little Latina. Oh Facial expression. Angry. <laughs> that's anguish? <laughs> yeah, when somebody I know dies, that's definitely the face I make. That's like the... What did you put in my drink? Oh, this is fantastic. I'm gonna be disgusted the whole time. Uh, movement style. This is absolutely incredible the kind of customization we have here. Lady Pin. I like it. I really do. Yeah, me too. I'm gonna pick that one. Taunt. Where they may. Ooh, I said something nasty. No, no, no. No traigas esa mierda para acá. Yeah, whatever that is, that's so my character's personality. Okay, I think we're ready to go. This is a great character. She got a lot of attitude. You really expect me to trust some guy I don't even know? Everything she says, I just want to go, yeah! I want to be her posse. Yeah. The hell I do, I got the saint. The hell I do! She even said that! Holy shit. Coolest character ever. Yeah, this guy's helping me. Yeah, we're all in sync and shit. Ooh, we did it. Do it, do it. No, no, no. No try because I'm... <laughs> telling me how to taunt. <laughs> I already taunted. Yeah, but yeah. Okay. But whatever it is, it'll be better than being in a coma. Ooh, yeah, coma. It's incredible. I've already been introduced to a variety of weapons and vehicles, and also gaining experience at a turret shooting down boats and helicopters. How much more action do you want to cram into the intro of the game? I'm pretty sure it's as good as it gets. Awesome. So this week's shout out is going to Slap Ready. Q shout out. There you go. Mission complete. Warming their hands on fire. Yeah, me too. Oh, these got a little newspaper and umbrella. This is cute. <laughs> what are you what are you doing there? Are you just uh, taking a nap and you're a little hungover? Maybe you shouldn't have been such a fucking dick to me. What okay. Are you gonna ask me some questions? Maybe you should learn how to report better. Ask me about my cosplay. I'm dressed up as this chick from Saints Row 2. I love how in like Grand Theft Auto games and in this game, I always have these really heartfelt conversations in the middle of like this bloody mission. Is this really the time to bond? But I guess living life a criminal is really God damn it! Stop teaching me things. When I go to school, that is not how they teach you things. Boom! This is X plus Y equals Z. Boom! Uh, prepositions and verbs and stuff. Get hold of this. Okay, we're gonna back in, which is very hard to do. There we go. Parking. There we go. Nice work. You can pass our driving test. Now we kill people to celebrate! Out of the car, asshole. Fuck you, asshole. Asshole, asshole, asshole. Look at the only word we know. Street alien man? His cranium is totally shaped funny. We're gonna help him cross the street with guns. Stop! Let him go! Are you reading? Loser. That all there is? Oh, she was practicing her kana on her laptop. This guy's on a cell phone in the movie theater. Shut up! Shut up! You're wearing. 
shoes with no socks? Dead. Ugly. I hate you. But if I was playing No More Heroes, I would deposit uh, LBs in here to fight the next match. Which we can just pretend that I did. There, you deposit it. And here we go, we're fighting the chick. And I win. And that is what I do when I win. No, no, no. No traigas esa mierda para acá. And then I do that. Because <laughs> I'm a hardcore otaku. Something for Muffin. <laughs> this is a joke I would make. Let's break these. Beastro. Crappy name. I hate in places that have totally generic names like that. Like cleaners. You couldn't come up with a name. I can fart a better name than that, okay? That's the name of this cleaners. I'm gonna become a critic. And I'm gonna rate this painting right now. I like it. I really do. Yeah, mm hmm She likes it. This, on the other hand. No, no, no. No traigas esa mierda para acá. That means that it sucks. That painting is ugly. Cool. Ooh, wet t-shirt contest. With my silk. <gasps> what a cool pose. Alright, that's enough. I've got to say that I am extremely happy with this game. There are so many things to be excited about. First of all, the intro, fucking amazing. I mean, Escape from Prison, the whole boat scene, that was excellent. And it was a great way to set up the story, your character, and, you know, learning all the controls, everything, getting used to a bunch of different guns. It's fantastic. Very well done. Second of all, custom ability is insane. You can customize everything. Your home, your face, your clothes, everything. And I'm so excited about that because it helps you identify with the character, I think, for me, more quickly. Because you're creating the character so you're already like kind of in tune instead of just jumping into somebody's shoes. There's a wide selection of vehicles. Uh, the controls are pretty tight. Um, there's also a wide selection of weapons and you get to pretty much get a taste of them from the start, which I think is great because you're gangsters who already know how to use all these weapons, so there's no reason that they should like keep them from you and save them till later. You can also do wield right from the start, which is awesome. I mean, I don't know what other word to use for that. That's kick ass. There's a lot of things to do. Lots of side missions, lots of regular missions, lots of other little things to do. There's strip clubs, a plastic surgeon, which I think is really cool. And there's well, it's a pretty big city. There's lots of little nuances, as you could see from when we were doing our little walk. So I'm really excited to just go around, have some fun playing around, just goofing around. It's a great game you just pick up, goof around. It's really fun. But of course, if you want to get serious with it, get right down to missions. I don't know if I would play Saints Row One because this game is so kick-ass. Like I wouldn't want to take a step back because I'm so excited about this one. But I don't know, I might have to give it a try to size them up a little bit. So, if Dr. Sadie tries to take this game away from me, I'm going to shoot her again. And this time it'll be somewhere where it'll really hurt. Like her computer. Well, I'm feeling much better, and thankfully Ultra Echo is also. Saints Row 2 is a sandbox game with varied gameplay and plenty of action. This remedy is definitely effective. That's all from the lab this week, so until next time, stay tuned and... Stay infected.